And I'm Riley Cahill. Here with your broadcast for the week of October 26, 2020. It's almost Halloween, Mustangs. Let's head on over to Peyton for your school news. On to you, Peyton. Hey Mustangs, I'm Peyton Willis, and this is your school news for the week. Diversity and inclusion has been a popular and important topic at PC and many other schools in the past few months. We are so glad that we have our own equity, diversity, and inclusion school improvement team at PC. This team involves both students and teachers working together, trying to make Port Central a more safe and inclusive school. Now let's talk to a couple people who are part of this amazing team. There are things that are happening that are unacceptable. You know, our, our goal is to create a school where every student, regardless of who they are, um, feels like they belong here, feels like they're an equal part of what it is that we're doing at Portage Central High School. And um, they know that, that they are valued and, and um, don't feel that they're being excluded. Well, I'm kind of hoping that we can, I guess, it's like just spread, just spread the idea of embracing differences around the school. Back to you, Riley and Parker. Thanks, Peyton. On to you, Gavin. Hey, what is up, guys? It's Gavin here, back again with another comedy segment. Today, we will be trick-or-treating inside of the school. We have SpongeBob, a cow person, a hot dog, and Parker. <laughs> Let's get going. Trick-or-treat! <laughs> Lord, you're welcome. Bye, cool club. Thanks. Bye! Bye. Molly began. Thank you, Mr. Baker. Yeah, you're oh, Mr. Baker. Yes. Oh, oh so close. Trick or treat. Not the best. That's all we got for today. Now back to you in the studio. Great job, Gavin. Now on to you, Emma, for athletics. Parker and Riley, now let's take a look at what's happening in sports this week. Hey Mustangs, I'm Brenica Thrash with your athletics for this week. Starting Monday, there's a girls varsity volleyball game at four o'clock. On Tuesday, there's also a girls varsity swim meet at 6.30 in the Ported Central Natatorium. So good luck, ladies. On Thursday, there's another girls varsity volleyball game at four o'clock at Harper Creek High School. And lastly, this Saturday is the Varsity Cross Country Regional Meet. This is taking place at 11.30 a.m. at Portage West Middle School. Good luck this week, Mustangs. Back to you in the studio. Looking good, Mustangs. Now back to you, Parker and Riley. Thanks, guys. Now on to your activities of the week. Hey, Mustangs. Did you know that Portage Central has joined the competitive eSports world? You can join in the fun by attending practices on Wednesdays or Thursdays at 4 o'clock. Students are perfecting their skills with Coach James Crow. They run drills, develop strategy, review game footage, and compete against other teams. This is a great way to stay active and COVID safe as you can play from your own home. If you are interested, reach out to Mr. Crow or a student on the team. There are currently teams playing Rocket League, Valorant, League of Legends, Overwatch, Fortnite, and Super Smash Bros. Check out their Instagram for more info and some pictures. You know, Riley, Halloween isn't the only significant event happening soon. Let's head over to Emory to learn about Gen Z's Rock the Vote. Off to you, Emory. Hey, Mustangs. It's such an important time in today's world because the election is just around the corner. Though younger generations seem to show a lot of support for either party, it's surprising to hear that around 48% of voters aged 18 to 35 didn't vote in the last election. Let's hear from first-time voter and what she has to say about the upcoming election. Hi, my name is Leah Baker. I'm a senior here at PC. I just turned 18 and I am now registered to vote. And for those of you that took government, you know that Michigan is traditionally a swing state. So voter turnout in Michigan can actually change the course of the election. So to my 18 year old friends and my teachers that have not yet voted, I highly encourage you to hit the polls and make sure that your voice is heard. Hi, my name is Maddie and I'm a senior. I am planning on voting in the upcoming election. I think it's important that young people use their voice and exercise the right to vote in order to ensure that our president is a reflection of the people's choice. Please make sure to vote if you are eligible to do so and use your voice to make a difference in this country. Back to you in the studio, Riley and Parker. 
Thank you, Emery. Make sure to get out there and vote if you can. Well, that's all for this week, Mustangs. Make sure to tune in next week for more on what's happening around PC. I'm Parker Mason. And I'm Riley Cahill. Signing, Signing off. off. <laughs> Make sure to have a fun but safe Halloween, Mustangs. Thank you.